Good morning, children. Great to see you. Do you know what's behind me? Yes, rice field. Plants. Mm, it's just 8 o'clock in the morning here in the lowland, but it's already 29 degrees Celsius. Yes, it's hot. Anyway, I used to feel sorry for these plants when I was a little girl. But when I had science classes, I've totally understood. Do you know how much sunlight hits the plants? Well, if I were a plant, I would burn. But let me tell you, as plants need the sunlight to give it energy, we need God to fill us with joy and wisdom, to do good work, important good work. God is the source of our power. I am filled with great joy that God gives me the energy and wisdom to make this video for you all. And you are so blessed to receive the power of His Word today. Just like Peter when he was able to make a layman walk in Jesus' name. Yes, he was able to make a layman walk just because God gave him the power. Do you remember Jesus healing miracles? Jesus healed a paralytic man. Jesus raised a boy to life again as Jesus saw his mother was crying. Jesus made a blind see. All these miracles showed that the divine power of Jesus attested that he is indeed the Son of God. When Peter made the lame man walk, all who saw it was amazed. And Peter said to these people in Acts chapter 3 verse 12, Men of Israel, why do you wonder at this? Or why do you stare at us? As though by our own power or piety we have made him walk. Peter tells the people that he doesn't have the power to heal the man. The power came from Jesus. And this applies to all of us. Just as plants need the sunlight to give them the energy to sustain themselves by producing sugar and nutrients, we need the love of God to fill us with joy, wisdom, ability to do the good work or important works. The source of our power is God. Let us pray. Jesus, you were very compassionate to the people that needed to get healed, not just physically but spiritually. People need you as their personal savior. How can we be Jesus' representatives? Please help us pray for those who are anxious. Please remind us that whenever we are weak and not confident to do the things that you want us to do, please be our source of confidence. May we be all Christ's witnesses. Christ live in us today and forever. Amen.